Hey, this is Dan from MSS Enduralist, and welcome to our question and answer video. Time to time I get an email with a uh, question in it dealing with survival or urban survival, which are pretty much the same thing. So that some people classify them with wilderness and, and urban in an SHTF situation. And today I'd like to take a few minutes and answer some of the better questions, as I call them, that I've received. So, let's get started. First question is, how would one mitigate the damage or issues from a disaster and or an SHTF situation? Well, with my, the way I do things, I believe the impo most important thing is skills having skills to do things information information on what's really going on pre-planning preparing and then speed of action being able to react to the problem quickly second question was why do you believe that the gray man method is better than the full battle rattle method in an SHTF situation. Um, I came to that conclusion for myself uh, quite a while ago when I started thinking about the fact that sure you can dress up in your full camo and your AR and your chest rig and go out and I believe that will make you a target. Somebody will want to try you because you're putting on this persona of an alpha dog and in those situations one of the great things they're going to have is they're going to take down, try to take down the alpha dogs to get what they want. So I believe that the gray man method is a better method. It is better to not be seen it is better to blend into the background and avoid that than constantly having to fight your way through situations. And remember, the bad guy in the Marauder only has to get lucky with a bullet once. In order to survive, you have to get lucky and be lucky 100% of the time. Last question for this video is why do you believe that it is better to build defenses and bug in rather than bug out? And it's very simple. If you look at the news and the information that we get today, by the time you're completely aware that an SHTF situation is happening, something global, something that's going to drop society is happening, it is already too late to bug out. Everybody else knows, no matter what your escape route is, it's going to be ten times more dangerous. Information is a wonderful thing, it's a very powerful thing, it's an important thing to have. But you can never believe that you exclusively have that information. And I firmly believe that by the time an event happens that will snowball into an SHTF situation, by the time we're aware of it, it will be too late to do anything other than hunker down and hope for the best. So, this is Dan from MSS Enduralist. I'll be doing a few more of these question and answer videos. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Um, if you have di differing ideas than what I said, I'd love to hear about them. And so, until next time, take care of each other.